Hello everybody, I am Caesar. We are on board the Carnival Breeze. I'm gonna give you guys a tour from floor to floor. We're gonna start at the bottom, work our way to the top. So come along with me, let's take our tour. We're gonna start with Deck Zero. Deck Zero has the medical center, so if you're having an emergency or you need to get help, go down to Deck Zero. And the other thing they have is the gangway. The gangway is used when you're embarking or disembarking from the ship, like when you go to a port and you leave or enter the ship. We are on the third floor, also known as the lobby, and we're right in front of Carnival Adventures. If you guys are trying to book any type of excursion, you could book it here. You could book it before you get on the ship, but if you forget or if you change your mind, you could book it here on the third floor. We are on the third floor forward. We are in the atrium right here, and we're right in front of the Breeze Bar. On top of the Breeze Bar, they usually have live music, and a lot of people are just hanging out here. They have seats. They're chilling, they're drinking. It's a nice place to come and chill. We are on the third floor forward and right behind me you can see guest services. This is where everybody goes to check their statements, to see how much you've been tipping, to see how much you've been spending. You can see your account here. Most people come here to get the free deck of cards. I tried getting it earlier and they were sold out. They didn't have any more. So no free deck of cards here, but that is a good tip. You could also do most of the stuff here at the sell and sign kiosk, which I'm gonna show you guys right here. You could check your account balance and do pretty much everything there. If you don't have a problem and you need to speak to a person, I suggest you use the kiosk because it's a lot less line. We are now on the third deck and behind me we have the Blush Restaurant. It is on the third and the fourth deck. So it's two floors and it's all the way in the back. They call it the aft, so it's forward mid and aft which is all the way in the back and that's where we're at right now third deck we are now on the fourth floor and the fourth floor is also known as the mezzanine or fourth floor mezzanine deck we are currently on the fourth floor forward and we are at the ovation theater they do fun shows here and they also have bingo here so it's on the third floor and the fourth floor forward we are now on the fourth floor aft, which is all the way in the back, and we're in front of Club 02. This is where all the cool kids hang out that are 15 to 17 years of age. So right next to Club 02, you have Circle C, and this is for kids from 12 to 14 years of age. We're on the fourth floor aft, and we are now at the Warehouse Arcade. We are now on the fourth floor mid and I'm right here next to Thrill Theater. It costs $5.50 if you want to see a show or you could get unlimited cruise package for the whole week and that's going to be $15. Oh hey, I'm on the fourth floor and I'm at the library right now. You could rent books, you could check them out, you could sit down, you could read them and you got a bunch of people playing card games right now so that's what they're doing here in the library. We are now on the fourth floor forward and we're at the Sapphire Restaurant. This is if you had any time dining and it's on the fourth floor and also it's on the third floor. We're now on the fourth floor forward. This is the Pixels Gallery. This is where you would come to purchase any pictures or any picture packages from your cruise. We are now on the Cherry on Top. This is where you can get any sweet fix that you have. They got all kinds of candy and they also have roses if you're feeling a little bit romantic. We are on the fifth floor forward and we have a couple different stores here. We have Cherry on Top. We have our funnel gear. We even have an Island Trader, which is more of a general store. And then they have the fragrances. They have alcohol and they have cigarettes all the way at the end. And this is all on the fifth floor. We are now on the fifth floor mid, the Winner's Luck Casino. And you got everything here, blackjack, you got hold'em, you got slot machines. Come on in and we're gonna take a tour. If you're looking to gamble at the casino, it is 18 and up, and this is a designated smoking area for you smokers. You can smoke here in the casino. We're on the fifth floor mid. We are in front of the Plaza Cafe. This is where we come in the morning to get our coffees. You get a specialty coffee. You can get your Rockstar Energy drink. They even have Gatorades here on the fifth floor mid. We are on the fifth floor right outside the cafe. I have Pig and Anchor behind me. It is closed right now. When it is open, the line is crazy. If you 
like barbecue, this is gonna be your spot right here. And there's also two jacuzzis right here on the deck. So if you're looking for that, these are a little bit more private than the ones upstairs. We are on the fifth floor on the other side of the cafe now. And we're right next to the Red Frog Pub. You got foosball behind me. You have shuffleboard. You even have the beanbag toss that's outside on the deck. And then you have a pub field. You could have a seat, you could have a drink, and you could order some food here. We are on the fifth floor mid. We're pretty close to the back, which is the aft, and we're right in front of Liquid Nightclub. We're gonna show you guys what it looks like once it's going down. Everybody likes partying here. You can dance and all that good stuff right here. It's going down. Now we are on the fifth floor aft, which is all the way in the back. We're in front of the Piano Bar 88. I'm gonna show you guys a little bit what it looks like when someone's actually in there playing piano, and it is nice to listen to. Could it be? Now we are on the fifth floor aft, which is all the way in the back, and we're in front of the Limelight Lounge. This is where you do karaoke, and also this is where the comedians perform at. Next to the Limelight Lounge, you have the Fahrenheit Steakhouse. This is actually extra, but I heard it is delicious if you plan on eating here. We are on the fifth floor and we have Bonsai Sushi right behind me. The California rolls are only $5 and we heard they're delicious. We plan on eating here later on and we will let you guys know how it tastes. We are now on the sixth deck. There's nothing but staterooms here. Also on seven, also eight, and also nine. So we're gonna work our way to the 10th floor to the Lido deck. There's a lot more to do on the 10th floor. We are now on the 10th floor mid and there is a lot to eat here. This is the buffet area. Behind me you have the Mongolian walk and that's just one of the restaurants they have here that's included in your meal ticket. If you have a sweet tooth, you got the sweet spot right behind me and they got all kinds of delicious looking cakes you guys can see for yourself. If you're looking for a buffet, they have a line that's called Good Eats and this is your typical buffet food. They have chicken, they have beef, they have pork and before that they actually have a salad bar. So it's a salad bar that leads right into the buffet. We are now on the 10th floor next to the entrance of Cucina del Capitano. You have to go up the stairs and it's actually on the 11th floor but the entrance is on the 10th floor. And if you want pasta, it's complimentary for lunch but it's a limited pasta menu. If you guys want dinner, it costs $15 per adult and they open up their full menu. We are now in front of the Carnival Deli and here they have sandwiches, they have wraps, they have buffalo chicken, they have hot dogs and any of that good stuff right here. We are now in front of Pizza Pirate which is 10th floor aft all the way in the back and they have your pepperoni, they have your mushrooms, they have your cheese. My favorite is pepperoni and the good thing about here it's 24 7 so you could order a pizza in the middle of the night if you want at 3 a.m. so be aware of that. So we are on the 10th floor aft all the way in the back. I got Pizza Pirate behind me. We're gonna go this way to Tide's Bar. So this is over here. We have two jacuzzis and then we have a pool right in the middle of the two jacuzzis. We have a beverage area over here on this side and then we have the seafood shack all the way to the back side. But just to warn you guys, it is not complimentary. You do have to pay if you're gonna eat there. So on the 10th floor forward, you're gonna have a bigger pool. You're gonna have people dancing, they have a DJ, and then you have two restaurants and two bars. The first restaurant is Guy's Burgers, which I highly recommend, delicious burgers. The second is Blue Iguana Cantina. They have tacos and burritos. The first bar is the Blue Iguana Tequila Bar. And then the second bar is the Red Frog Rum Bar. We are at Camp Ocean, 11 mid. This is the kids club for all the kids. They have different ages, so you guys are gonna see what ages, but they have three clubs up here. On the 12th floor forward, you have Waterworks, which is one of the main attractions for kids. It's also fun for adults. You have a bunch of slides. You guys just watch for yourself. 12th floor also has a track, so you could either walk, jog or run on this track and it laps all the way around the 12th deck. The 12th floor also has an outdoor gym called Sky Fitness, an outdoor basketball court, but good luck trying to play if it's windy. Pool table, mini putt-putt golf, good luck trying to play if the water's a little choppy because the ball does move. 
Uh, you have a ping pong table, cornhole, and they also have a sky course, which is a fun high rope course activity. 12th floor forward has a pretty good sized fitness center with free weights, machines, and treadmills. We are on deck 12 forward. This is the entrance to the Cloud 9 Serenity Spa. And then there's an elevator in there that takes you to the 14th floor, which is the Serenity Spa. And then you go up to the 15th deck and that's where you have the Serenity Adults Only section. They have loungers here, they have two hot tubs, and they also have a bar up here. I hope you guys enjoyed the tour of the Carnival Breeze. I do have more Carnival Cruise tip videos down in the description box below so check those out and see you on the next video